I'm going to show you how to put together the uh, magnetic arms for the Rostock Max. Uh, this version of the arms is a uh, all printed version, the rod that goes in the middle uh, between the two connectors is printed. Here's a version I did with the uh, carbon fiber as the rod and I, I don't think I could get it quite the right length um, just cutting it. Um, so I tried a different way of printing it and it turned out pretty good. Um, the rod is a pentagon. You can see that shape. And it seems to print pretty well uh, rather than trying to print a, a circle, um, a cylinder. Um, I've got in the end a, a vertical hole the size of a filament and a horizontal hole and the same on, on the other side. And then on the connector that actually meets up with the ball and then has magnets in it. Uh, it's got matching holes too. And you just put the magnets in, line up the holes, and put the filament through. So I'm going to show you how to do that. <clears throat> Just need to kind of clean it up a little bit. The cup needs to be kind of smooth. On both of them. side where the, the magnets go all the way down, they uh, make sure that little platform they rest on doesn't have any extra pieces of plastic on it. So I start with two of these magnets. These are three inch thick uh, by uh, ten inches in, or ten millimeters, three millimeters thick by ten millimeters in diameter. Push them down in there. It's a little, little snug. Get two more for a total of four on each side. Check the polarity on that. <clears throat> okay. And then match up the holes on here. Oh, I need to clean, clean out these little holes. And you really want to err on the side of not cleaning it out too much. And where's my filament?
and then uh, you take like a soldering iron and, and, and melt that down to a little disc on both sides. Check the holes And there 